spell happened. Hey there, everyone, this is Al Cowbling, a whole new world. I got two cores, and the game is reminding me, like, continued ones. So I got, yeah, I got this. So, like, I, so the demo showed this blowing up. If I charge up, I still throw my fairy, so I don't know how I get the blowing up, or I guess it's when it counter thing. So I got a bouncy ball. Anyways, hey there, everyone, this is Al Cow. Well, I missed that thing by not knowing it was gonna be there, that's fine. Um, playing, yeah, a whole new world, getting my head stuck in a thing. And, um... I don't know why I feel like these holes are death rather than flipping. Oh, that's neat. Okay, yeah, yeah, but sometimes they burn, sometimes they pop. Alright, good fun. Running across the one tile gaps, don't worry about those. It's a zombie! Be frozen, zombie. Whoa, you can really spam this though. And look at this colorful nightmare hallway that I've created. I love it. Yeah, so here on Smog Up, in the whole new world. So, I, something I feel like I, I, I need to say. Uh, I, I don't mean to like brag or anything. Whoa, that thing's just come. Oh, geez, buddy. Buddy, buddy, buddy. Like, so I remember, like, a lot of the advertisable advertisement. Like, I feel like a big chunk of the game's messaging was that, you know, it's a pretty hard game. And, like, I feel like all the rev reviews were about that. But, I don't know, I feel like... Although the level design, the obstacle design, like, can get a bit spammy with just, like, check out all these animal enemies. Whoa, watch out. I feel like it hasn't been that hard yet. I mean, so, there's two possibilities. That guy's pretty cool. Uh, is the head is leaking. <laughs> is that one? Um... I don't know where I was going with that. Oh, there's a skull thing here, so watch out. Oh, it's a big heart that we saw! Okay, wait, so I just... Okay, we're gonna be going through several, like, things and then something's gonna happen. That's the vibe I'm getting. Can I shot this? Like, this wall? Okay, maybe not. So, like, either there's gonna be, like, a huge difficulty spike at some point that, honestly, that can happen. There's also the possibility that maybe I'm just okay at video games, but I don't know. This feels like a distant second possibility. More than- what? what hit me? I don't know, you- uh, it's because the blood is pooling and you can't see the little guys. So, I'm assuming that whatever I'm doing down these hallways is gonna open up these, um, these fun little walls we got all over the place. You know, as a reminder of what hope looks like. And, um, and yeah, that's what we're doing. See, there's a unicorn here. It's- well, whoa! What did you just throw up? Gross. Yeah, just getting rid of your lunch on me, you know? Do you think I'm like the lunch repository? And I don't think so, because that sounded really- Oh, see, there's a heart. Yeah. Yeah! Wow! That is unnecessarily graphic. I love it, though. <laughs> okay, yeah, and see, look at that. All, oh, yeah, it made like a big mess. This is beautiful. Got it. Now we're gonna go back, but all the things will be opened. So you go a lot slower on uh, these in in the muck, but like it must be like pretty thick, cause like it's not all just flowing out of the thing. Eyeball man, just look at you. It's like, hey, I'm a Rinka. How do you do? I'm doing fine. Thank you for asking. Oh yeah, seeing that wall is opened up now, and that lets us go where the skull used to be. There we go. We figured things out. I'm gonna get that eyeball. Yeah, no eyeball club. Okay, yeah, we're gonna do that a couple of times. Four times, two times. Buddy, oh, these guys are pretty strong. I say, based on the fact that they take more than one hit to kill. All right, here's the one tile club, and they fall too. All right, it's a donut. Hey, crystal. I am absolutely certain that I'm missing out on all the crystals, but like the way the game is designed, like it's not really inviting to the concept of getting all the pickups. Cause like the game is linear, I don't know if there's like an easy way to go back to past levels, but like if you know what you're missing after you're done, I don't know, it's just not super inviting. I'm gonna freeze a Neary. Can you, like, use them? Oh, you can use them as platforms, too, and everything. Yeah, this is a really fun weapon. And I just love, yeah, and, yeah. 
I mean, yeah, it's terrible if you don't have a ceiling, but here we have a ceiling, so, you know, I don't care. I'm pretty happy with what I got, but here, for you guys, this is the smart... This is a smart thing to do, and then you ignore the bubble that just kind of came your way. This is soap, soapy mess for a soapy day. Now we are hunkering down the path. Clearly, a bunch of bats will be here. Set the world on fire for me. Whoa, and then fall awkwardly. <laughs> like I don't think I gain anything from setting this whole mosh pit ablaze, but. <laughs> It's worth it. Uh, it's really funny. It's just fun. Alright, here's these guys. No, no worry about them. I'm gonna eat this chicken. Can't stop me. It's the beautiful je- Whoa, the beautifully sick jelly corn. Okay. Okay, so probably they'll vomit up chunks or they'll breathe out another kind of infection. This is a real bad time. This has been had by everyone here. Including the jelly corn. All right, and then, yeah, all these are gone, then it's like, whoa, welcome to bats. All right, here we go, Bat Town, the enemy of video games. Here we go, I'm gonna eat these chicken. Like, should I hang back and destroy all these bats? Like, do they stay in memory? Are they gonna affect the game? I guess there's nothing... I can just sit here and throw stuff around, like, it's fine. And then they're gone, it's like, yay, I did it. See, this is why there was all the ceiling bats. Because you got, oh jeez, yeah, okay, you know what, yeah, if they're gonna come back, you know, you probably do want to clean up a little bit. That zombie expired, it ran out of zombie-ness. That's fine, I'm surprised I didn't just kill everyone when I wasn't on my way, but I was going at it pretty quickly. Alright, so you could go down this pit if you wanted, but I know for a fact that I got some chicken legs waiting for me somewhere. I guess maybe not. Well, I could go down there. Wasn't there like chicken legs around here? Well, here there's a brand new opening up for me at a branch, a regional branch of eyeball medicine. Uh, okay, I got you, I think. No, I'm not. I'm not like killing you at all. Okay, you can eventually. Ooh, spikes. I landed on you. I we're back here. Oh, buddy, buddy, buddy. I need that chicken. I need it more than you do. You're not even eating it. All right, thank you for cooperating. All right, so now we go inside another skull. Indeed, use a barrier to barriate. Oh, I thought the fairy was uh, was an enemy. <laughs> so here's a funny thing about this game. So like, it gives you a whole like a weapon every level, right? Like Mega Man style. But the thing with Mega Man is that you know, like you choose the order you do things, right? Like, so, like, I feel like it makes sense when you find a new weapon that you can apply to a new process and everything. But I feel like that doesn't really work. Oh, what am I seeing here? Okay, so... Okay, so... Okay, so... What are we actually doing here? This is... A bit weird. A bit hard to navigate. Alright, so I can do that to destroy up above. I can use that to go here. Maybe one day I can shatter this. There we go. Yeah, okay, where is Eyeball Johnny Beans? Because I'm not a fan, but I think I'm just gonna have to make do. Alright, Eyeball Johnny Beans. He's gonna bean your eyeball spleen. What? That, that what? No, that's not a sentence. That's not a real statement. Okay, I, see, I feel like I'm just putting myself in a danger, sticking around here. Like, maybe I can just kind of, like, ignore this more or less. Like, kind of maybe hang out here, you know? Oh, jeez, there's a lot of eyeballs up. And, like, you know, kind of get down here a little bit, eat a little bit of a fire. What? No, that's not what I meant to say, but it is the words that came out. Alright, save zoned. Yeah, one side has all the eyeballs. On the other, there's the jelly corn. Right into the poison of the jelly corn. Favorite bedtime story right there. Okay, oh, you can just kind of stick close and do that. It's just that then if it does the smoke attack, you might not be able to react. I don't know, that would be bad, I guess. What am I looking at here? I think you are asking me to like... Yeah, bounce a little something like that. 
and in such a way that, uh, oh, like that maybe, that it gets to the heart. There you go, it got to the heart! Right to the heart! And the bat's away! Now I can go ahead and eat a meal. Fantastic. Alright, so, yeah, so the game, whoa, knows for a fact. That you have all the weapons you have. Oh jeez, uh, it doesn't look what I want to do. So it looks to be alternating when it hits a thing. Like when you throw it, it's fire. Then it turns into ice after it bounces on one thing. Pretty simple acts of physics. Nothing to worry about. Oh jeez, what just happened there? I don't know. Okay, well we're going down here now. I am being aggravated by a whole bunch of projectiles. That's just the price of doing business. Okay, okay, seems relatively safe-ish. It's like this big old like, caramel corn of fire there. Like, I don't know what's up with that, but it's kind of fun. You know, let's just kind of burn our way through here. And look at that, that's exactly where I needed to burn my way through. Anyways. Oh, we did it! We walled off the heart! Yeah, okay, whoa! It's back! Okay, so we're fighting those directly now, huh? Okay, uh, not sure what to do about this. They don't have a health bar like previous proper bosses. So this could just be a side zone. I don't know. I like these weapons though, because you can spam them very easily. Like, unlike other flavors of potion, I got. Whoops, I just died, but I just gained a life. Wait, no, 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 keep me there, fairy. Fairy? So now I have to start a whole fight over. <laughs> okay, so... During levels, you will be respawned exactly where you were. But during a boss fight, not necessarily. Maybe I should concentrate on like... Yeah, I absolutely do want to concentrate on a specific spell at a time. Alright, got it. Yeah, I don't know why I was spreading around like that. Like... In terms of tactics, that makes absolutely no sense. I agree. I'm just kind of falling my nose, you know? Who can Sam? All right, uh, this is a, whoa, what was, what was that? Big old beam. All right, it's raining a light. Okay, you can just do that, huh? All right then. It seems like you do, you're doing that as a group too? All right, well I can hide down here and uh, Esther you. I don't have any problems with that. Oh, big bye, oh, watch out. Big boys got the hongies. Uh, I don't know why I'm taunting you like that. It's very mean, but I am. How's it happen? All right, big ol' red orbs. Uh, watch out, the orbs are gonna sing songs at you if you let them. That big, big mean beady, big beat miney. Then we open up the path to the heart. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that was not the boss, boss. There's the heart down there. Uh, so something must have opened up somewhere. But what? <laughs> like, what do I do from here? I'm not sure. Like, I can return here and eat this. Like, it feels like this is supposed to be open. But it's not. This isn't open. Um, oh, could I not go? Okay, I couldn't go here before. All right, got it. Understood. Gonna eat my weight in chicken legs. And you're gonna watch. It's gonna be great. Some people, that is actually what they do. Oh, boy. Okay. Yeah, I know. It's just bad. So I'm just gonna dumb Maku up the ceiling a little bit. You know, just make it real hard for anyone to survive going anywhere close to where I am. That's just a lot. Oh, okay, that was a bad jump. I'm not sure what I was expecting. Not sure what I was expecting there either. Can you throw backwards? No, I think I'm safe from you here. Other than the fact that I am completely hungry and naked. Oh, what? oh I was... I was looking somewhere else. By which I mean the hut. <laughs> Didn't notice that he threw a thing at me. Yeah, like, you look at where I am, and you look at where the HUD is, and, like, I'm playing in full screen, right? So, uh, yeah, if my eye is down there, I'm not gonna see necessarily over there very well. 
All right, well, I'm gonna get a diamond. I don't know if it matters, but I got it, and it's mine. It's a little crystal thing. Welcome to the Orange King. I'm gonna want to eat this chicken leg in case I need it? Question mark. Like, I don't, I don't know. Like, whoa, hey, it's the jelly corn. Yeah, so when it, when it lowers its head like that, yeah, that's when you want to jump. I'm very good at that. <laughs> that's why I left this completely infected piece of poultry there for me to eat at a later date, all right? Good, I'm glad we had this conversation. Uh, uh there's a heart. Have a heart. It's mine! Please get rid of this bat. You know, most bats are good people. But that one, I, I, don't, I don't care. Is there something here? Yeah, there is. It's you. The little diamond. Give, the, the diamonds do give you a thousand points. And you know, like, points gives you lives, and lives makes it convenient <laughs> to go about on your destiny. As the potion master. Look at that. Look at this sweet, like, zigzag shape. The good old time. Then I can go here and like, yo, buddy, you seem pretty frozen there, guy. Does it check out and give me point? It does, okay. If my goal is getting points, since it's very unlikely that I'm ever gonna go back, I guess getting out of your way to get all the rampant legs of chicken is probably a good thing then. Uh, I feel like going down, because that's where the, like that trail in the back looks like it's going and soon leads you to this. These little yummy little crystals. A good time is somewhere. Alright, going down here. Oh. Oh, but now we opened up here. Right you are, Mr. Catfish. Please don't start an earthquake today. Here's the bloody shaft. Whoops. Button. I pressed it. That doesn't mean nothing. Alright, midpoint here. Are we gonna have a fight backwards? Against, uh, little Satan here? Little brown Aramur? Okay, uh, how do you dodge that? Like that! <laughs> Alright, so you got yourself a big fancy shield. But I have the ability to just litter the world with magic. Like, you know, I, I appreciate the effort and self-preservation. Whoa! No, 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 no! No touch, no touch. Wow, you didn't even remove me any damage. Whoa, jeez, there you did. Where am I? Oh, wait, so those pits kill? Fantastic. Alright, so be careful. Once it's on the ground, it might do that move. Uh, you know, what are you going to do when that happens? Alright, so for the most part, I'm just basically throwing stuff all over the place. And then you go over there, and then you're like, whoa, I'm here. You see, this time I dodge. But now I know to expect your, like, cannon beast rush move, right? Which is where the real deadliness is gonna be. There you go. Oh, you're naked, by the way. <laughs> I don't know if you've noticed. That's, I don't know if I want to be naked inside a uh, living organism. It just feels like a bad idea. Oh, look at that, my angle there is perfect for just kind of getting right by your big bloody shield, look at that! What a fool turning around. Who would turn around? Whoa! You know that magic is powerful because it barely has any frames. Uh, okay, so that's another thing you do. Okay, then don't fall in the hole! Okay, bloody mess! Wow! And I got a bloody spear! It's not a spear. Spearhead. Oh, that was really cool, though! That was lit blood potion. Yeah! <laughs> hey! Blood potion got me double jump. I'll take it. And a Mega Man slide. Whoa! Okay, so you can also Mega Man slide and do that. Oh, that is. Aw, oh, look at that little idle animation where he calms down. Did I ever notice that before? I mean, I don't idle, so it'll, it'll idle, it'll, it'll. Okay, we got like a ton of stuff, and next time we're going into the demonic board game. How else are you gonna interpret this? 
It's tiles with like little passageways that go from one place to another. How is that? There we go. I got a straightforward. I, I'm now Mega Man. I'm now double jumping Mega Man. And I'm here to say that I'm the potion master, and that's okay.